Joe wanted to know how to use the arpeggiator in Logic, so I'm going to make a podcast to show him and uh, possibly some of you how to do it. So I've got a track here that's already got some chords on it, and it's got a sound with a very sharp attack. So what I'm going to do now is go to the environment, because this is where you have to go to, in order to create an arpeggiator object in here. So I'm going to go to Window, and go down to Environment, or Command-8. And I'll make this a little bigger. Okay, under the New menu, there's an arpeggiator and a couple other options. I'm just going to do the arpeggiator this time. But uh, I would recommend playing around with the delay line, too, because it does some neat stuff. Okay, so I've got my arpeggiator, and I'm going to cable it to my instrument. Okay, and I'm going to give it a name so it's easier to find. Okay. Now, if I start playing right now, very plain, right? Still not doing any arpeggiation. Here's why. So I'm going to go back to my main screen. If um, you notice, it's still just set to go straight to the synth. So what I'm going to do is make another track. And I'm going to assign the object to the arpeggiator. So the way I'm going to do that is to control click on the object. And I'm going to assign it to my arp for synth here. Okay. Still nothing. But watch what happens when I do this. So you can see it's actually uh, playing that part arpeggiator now. If I go back to my um, window with the arpeggiator on it, oops, I forgot to do that the right way, but oh well. Um, when I'm looking at this uh, object, you have the settings over here that you can adjust. So if I wanted to change the way the arpeggiator works. You can see it's got a lot of op options there that you can play with and have some fun. Um, so just remember the trick. You might already have a track, but you have to create uh, the arpeggiator and you have to link it together. Also, this will only work when the sequencer is running. So if I wanted to hear these, I definitely have to have the play going. So if I just start playing some notes, they won't be arpeggiated, but if I start the sequencer running, so there you go.